how to do parade hair. We need to make sure no hair is touching the collar. There aren't any flyaway wispies. And make sure that everything is tucked away basically. So what we typically do is you have hairspray, one of the wood sticks that we only use one stick on one person. After we're done with that person, we snap it in half and then not use it again. You usually should have some bobby pins ready to go because once you spray the hairspray, you need to do the tucking and get the bobby pins in there before everything, the hairspray becomes fixed. Normally I like to warn the student, I'm going to spray your hair because particularly when they have an expensive instrument in their hand and they get a cold blast of hairspray, they kind of scream and like a clarinet, it could be dropped on the ground, which would not be a good idea. I'm going to spray you. Mm. I come in here and I block the collar. I'm going to try and talk with the bobby pin in my mouth. Okay, hold down here. Spray. Oops, don't have enough hands. Come in and then start tucking the hair up into the hat. While the hairspray is still wet and hasn't set yet. This part, I'm going to spray you again. Try not to get it on the uniform of the hat, preferably. Get it tucked up in there if you can. And then, using the bobby pins, get in there and now lock it in place. Typically, you can get away with doing a couple of X's across the back of the hair. One. Come in on the other side. Here. And this particular bunch over here worries me. So I might get up in there like that. So pretty much there might be a couple stray ones there. But I might come in and spray again. Come up with the stick. And Get them tucked up in there. You also want to check around the ears. Make sure there isn't anything a lot coming out of the sides. And if you manage to get some of them free like I just did, just spray it again. Cover her ear because that would be awful to get hairspray right up your ear. Get that tucked up in there. Check the front. And this isn't this will do. And now, remind the student that once we've done this, do not take off your hat until we're done with judging. 